Baka Deer Jalalov ended up getting the KO victory over Curtis Harper. So, um, all right, 6'7", 82-inch arm reach, Uzbek, heavyweight, 67, or 6'7", 82-inch arm reach, right? Now, Harper is 6'2". So you already knew how that was going to go anyway. But then you add in the record is 11 and 0 with 11 KOs coming into the fight. Now he's now he's 12 and 0. So he got a KO victory, right? But then you add in a crazy amateur pedigree. But then you add in gold medalist and you beat Richard Torres Jr. <laughs> for the gold medal in the Olympics. So, yeah, Jalalov, real deal. Now, the only thing that I can say about him is the fact that I think his jab is not good. It's just a range-finding jab. It's not really, uh, it's, it, he doesn't use the jab to set up his left hand, right? Another thing about this guy is he's he's a southpaw at that. So he's a 6'7 southpaw with an 82 inch arm reach. With amateur pedigree. With Olympic experience and a gold medalist. 11 and 0, 11 KOs come into the fight and now he's 12 and 0 with 12 KOs. Now. I don't think that they should rush him. I really don't because I think that they need to work on that jab a little bit better. That jab is not good. It's really not. So they need to work on that a little bit more. But other than that, man, that guy is that guy is amazing. He's he's bouncing on his toes. He's moving. Now it's very one dimensional though. It's not too much body work in there. There's a lot of head. There's a lot of stuff to the head. So. That might be something that they need to look at as well. I don't know if he has the angles yet as far as for body work. So that might be something that they might be working on in the gym. Who knows? But as of right now, from what I can see, yeah, he's nice. He's nice for sure. So 12 and 0, 12 KOs, Olympic gold medalist, Bakadir Jalalov, a name you definitely want to remember. So with that being said, as always, peace, one love, we out of here.